Hey, how's it going? Today we're going to go over how to draw a skull, Halloween skull. It's going to be simple, easy for beginners, so let's get started. I'm going to go over here, and I'm going to pull up over here on this side for kind of the cheekbone of the skull. Up on this side for the cheekbone on the other side. I'm going to curve around here now, okay? I'm going to curve, pull in, pull down. Kind of a, an elongated cheekbone to kind of make it stylized, right? line over here more or less just kind of copying that side as well we're kind of drawing like in a mirror cool cool now we're gonna pull up on over here on this side and uh, we're gonna pull up around the orbital bone on this over here on this side up around the orbital bone here okay I'm gonna go over here now and I'm gonna draw the top of the skull just kind of a round shape all right so I'm gonna start maybe part way there It's almost like an egg shape at the top, right there for the top of the skull. Don't forget, by the way, hit the subscribe button. Halloween is coming. We're going to be drawing tons and tons and tons of stuff. So absolutely hit the subscribe button and click that bell notification. I'm going to go over here now, and I'm going to draw the eye sockets now. So I'm going to make them kind of square. So pull line there, down, pull back, up. Over here, down, curve in up over here now like an upside down V shape and then kind of closing that off okay hopefully you're doing good so far like I said hit that like button if you like you know this channel this video absolutely hit the like it takes two seconds less than two seconds it takes like a split second line over here on this side for one kind of canine line over here on this side. You want a little bit of evilness to it, right? That we want to add to it for the Halloween season line across. By the way, who knows what they're going to be for Halloween? Does anybody have any uh, plans on terms of Halloween? Like what you guys want to do? Let me know. Line over here. Line over, I'm sorry, what you're going to dress up like? Because I don't really know myself, so. Curve over here. Go over here on this side, and we're, we're gonna draw them line all the way across. Now what we're gonna do is I'm gonna give it a little bit of a dimension to it. I'm gonna draw like a curve line like so, curve line like so, and I'm gonna fill this part in because it's gonna be a dark area there in the middle, dark area in the middle there, like so, and dark area right here. Let's go over here to the top crack area line over here line over here for kind of the dimples on the skull themselves they tend to do that and now I'm gonna go over here and draw a little bit of darkness right here to kind of show the underside of the skull you want there to be kind of um, something behind there behind here as well line 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 right here for i'm throwing little lines right here for the gum area right that's, that's kind of what we're we're looking for as well like the gums to be you know pretty you know there it kind of makes it a little bit more realistic and it gives it that more believability so right here on the bottom as well over here curving in curve up line over here and let's go over here on this side here and 
so far so good we're just kind of looking at this um well if i want to add anything to this i'm going to go over here and draw a line right here on the inside of that area and it this is like a partial shadow i'm drawing lines right there representing kind of like shadow but it's going to be a lot you know it's not quite shadow right shadow right here is represented by total total black but i'm putting that right there as kind of a stylistic thing uh hopefully you like this kind of stuff right you want to learn more style more any of that stuff like I said, stay with the channel. There's a lot of different ways to draw the skulls, a lot of different ways to draw pumpkins, a lot of different ways to draw bats, cats, you know, spooky houses, spiders, Jason Voorhees masks. There's so many different ways to draw these things. I just want to make them all very, very apparent to you. And that's kind of what I like. Like I said, if you like this kind of stuff, you know, absolutely subscribe to the channel. And the other thing is I want you to kind of pay attention to, uh, I'm going to put a little bit more dark down here. I want you to pay attention to uh, if you want to learn to draw in general, right? If you like this kind of stuff, go to the main website. It is sketchingeasy.com. Um, sketching go over there and click on the dragon. When you do that, it's going to give you a program, very simple program on how to kind of steady your hand, right? Because drawing has two parts. Number one, it has the kind of wiggliness of your hand, right? Like the kind of uh, physical parts of pulling strokes. And then two, it has the knowledge part of it, right? Like, oh, what is the anatomy of this, etc. I take care of the first part for you, the physical part of it. Uh, like, like if you have shaky hands, this will the program that I'm talking about, it's gonna get rid of it in a week, and it's completely free, no sign up, no nothing, just you know, good stuff. Go over there, check it out. Okay, that's pretty much the end of this. Uh, if you do want to add anything else, you could add maybe like, uh, you know, something symbolic around it. You could add maybe this stuff, like make it look like a sticker, right? By adding uh, some kind of surprise element around it. And you're thinking more like a designer in this way. Like so. Anyways. That's pretty much it. Um, please share the video if you like it. Um, stick around, I'm putting a lot more stuff. I'm gonna put three videos a day, uh, right now, at least during the Halloween season. Um, but yeah, uh, I don't know what I'm gonna dress like. I'm gonna try to figure that out. I'm probably gonna dress like, um, <sighs> I'm not sure. I'm gonna think of my Halloween outfit. So if you have any ideas, let me know in the comments, okay? I'm gonna reply to every single comment as well. So stick around for that. I'll talk to you next time, okay? See you soon, and uh, might even see you later today. Hey, for those of you that are a little bit more serious and you really want to kind of upgrade your art skill all around, uh, I have these beginner art lessons here on my Skillshare. So the idea with this is that some people that, you know, for example, on YouTube, people just kind of want to draw what's in the video and just generally have a fun time. They're not always concerned about the little details and stuff about learning uh, how to do this stuff, you know, long term. Um, and I get that. That's fun. But for some people, some people want to upgrade their art ability entirely, like all around, like they're serious about it. If that's you, go here. Um, like I said, there's programs here on even some of the same material. Like I said, it's just a lot more in depth. My eye drawing program is an hour as opposed to the video I have on YouTube, which is like 10 minutes, right? You can still learn from both, but like I said, if you really want more and you really wanna make this part of your life, go here. Um, I have same thing over here, how to draw a dragon head. I have anime, I have cartoons. There's categories for everything and everything is for beginners. Um, the other thing about this website is it's incredibly easy to watch it. This is like the Netflix of like drawing lessons. So you can go through the entire site, see everybody else's lessons. And normally the, the site costs like 30 to 40 bucks a month. Um, because you're watching this video right now, if you're still watching right now, you get it for free for at least a month, like 30 days. That's a lot. Um, but just you, what you have to do is go over here to the video, go down first link in the description, the very, very first link that gives you free access to this whole thing for 30 days. Um, you just go over here, you click this thing, boom, and then you sign up. Um, and it's super easy. And the, the cool part is you can just straight up cancel it before the 30 days is up 
and you never pay a single thing. You never pay a cent, and you got all this learning from it. Uh, but yeah, like I said, that's uh, an option for you guys. Uh, if you guys want to do it, absolutely go hit that up. Um, and that's it.